Hey guys, like always, we're lost over here. So um, I have to turn around now. We It is seven o'clock in the morning. It is Thursday today. We are on our way to Maryland to meet the owners of IAG. And so is to meet the, uh, the, the rest of the crew. We're gonna see the facility. We're gonna be talking to them about um, the product and um, the fact that we are um, I guess, uh, I don't know if I wanna put it this way, but we're a level two uh, sales reps or dealers. Uh, so it's pretty exciting stuff. I'm really happy about what's going on. So stay tuned guys, this video is gonna be awesome. Good morning guys it is about 7 30 right now we're here at the airport we just drop off the the car here in the parking lot we're at dfw airport in dallas um and uh it's almost four words more or less so we're heading heading out to maryland to see the guys at ieg we want to be there uh to learn a little bit more about the product and the whole history of the uh, company since we are now a part of their uh dealer program uh, we are reaching out a uh, new level for us, um, so it's really exciting to be a part of, of this experience and uh, to have a chance to learn a little bit more about them. So stay tuned, stay tuned for this video, it's going to be super exciting. It's going to be a really short video, but we, it's going to be very informative on what we're doing uh, and how we are getting to uh, talk to them and whatnot, so it's going to be a fun one. What do you think, Jake? I'm ready. You ready? Yeah. You ready to learn more about the product? Oh yeah. All right guys, well, let's see what's going on and uh, stay tuned for this one like I mentioned. Ooh. Well, I gotta, I gotta, gotta keep the mask on. What'd you well, get? What'd you get us? Well, we get well. Originally, we had a Honda Accord scheduled for the trip, but the person that uh, that was the one, the host, uh, couldn't communicate with us for some reason. So we end up selecting another car, and the one that was available happens to be this one. So hey, I'm not gonna complain if I drive a Mercedes here, but uh, why don't we just get out of here? Okay. <laughs> oh, it's so fancy. Man, these people are really, really uh, up to the customer service here. And gotta, uh, <laughs> they give you a mask. <laughs> they give you, what is this? Uh, scan the code, pick a ride. So uh, so these people actually do this for a living, not just for um, a car too. Need a car rental? Yes, flip it. Um, and got some uh, sanitizer here to be extra clean on the extra clean car. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, let's learn how to uh, put this in park. Yeah, I mean in drive. <laughs> in park. Yeah, in drive. To get the heck out of here. So now we got to do the check-in at the hotel. Uh, find some place to eat something. Guys, that that uh, that plane, uh, not the plane, but the, the flight was really rough at the end. We had a lot of turbulence. We had, It was really rough. Uh, I got sick and then Jake started making fun of me a little bit and then he started getting <laughs> sick So, uh, it was pretty bad. Hey, welcome to the East Coast where there is trees Yeah <laughs> <laughs> I've never been in Baltimore before Um, my first time here, so I guess we don't have a whole lot of time because it's just a business trip We literally got to go back, uh, tomorrow uh, we're heading out back home right around six or seven o'clock at night tomorrow. Uh, so it's just a one-day trip. We're gonna we're gonna see what we can around here. Uh, we we still have a, a you know a few hours to spare to to spend. Uh, we're gonna give you guys a little shot of Baltimore for those of you guys that have never been here, and uh, obviously to give you guys a, a, an insight of what we're 
what we're seeing too so you also can enjoy um, alongside with us so what well, hey man I can help it so the car is due for an oil change I'm already feeling the rotors a little shaky oh, God. I'm already diagnosing the car I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to tell the guy hey man your rotors are due <laughs> came over here to uh, have a meeting but no I'm here diagnosing the car that I rented um, getting to know this thing get into uh, touch buttons um, and enjoy the uh, the radio station because this thing is asking me to connect um, Apple CarPlay when part so I can't put my reggaeton music or my uh, boom 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 until I part so. What do you think, Jake? You think you're gonna learn Spanish now by listening to this reggaeton? By listening to this reggaeton? It helps. It helps. Yeah. What's I, your I, favorite part? I, dale, I, don't dale. Yeah, that's the only part I understand. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, guys, we're looking for something to eat. This is. Uh, I want to get out of the city here, the town. I mean, uh, we met somebody in the uh, in the plane that uh, she's actually wanting to start her YouTube channel too. She, we we're just talking about she does IT and she's doing real estate now. And uh, we we're just talking about the experience. I mean, I'm very new to this, um, but I'm sure you guys have seen a little bit of tiny progress uh, on this. So we were just sharing, you know, the ideas and whatnot. And she was telling me that the best place to eat here is definitely downtown. So we'll need to find somebody, some place here to have some food. Let's see what we find. How long has it been? Dude, it's been so long. I haven't been in a Wawa in so long. It's insane. For those of you guys that don't know, I lived in Florida for some time. I think about two years, maybe. And there was a bunch of Wawa. And Wawa for me is like Bucky's in Texas. Yes. You got to go to Wawa. If you have a Wawa next to you, appreciate what you have because this is something different. Wawa is special. Bucky's and Wawa's, yes. All the yes. Good morning, guys. It is Friday now. Uh, we are on our way to IAG. We left the hotel already. We checked out already. And uh, after meeting with them, we're going to be heading home. So, uh, guys, stay tuned for this one. I'm really... I'm really uh, excited to meet the guys over there at IAG. Uh, we're gonna be showing you guys everything that's going on over there. Hey Jay, you know what's funny? What? We have not seen a lot of cars, uh, a lot, like a lot of sport cars here. No. I think well, in the whole trip we only seen one WRX. Just now. Kind of funny how uh, one of the biggest companies for Subaru, Performing Parts, uh, it's off of Maryland, and I have not seen, you would think you would see a lot of these cars, but no, just one. I don't know, we'll have to find out. Well, it was hot yesterday, not today. <laughs> really cold in here. I have not seen a lot of sports cars, I'll tell you that much. Uh, we saw a few Mustangs that passed by. But uh, not Subaru. Another Eclipse. Oh yeah, for some reason, all the Eclipse are here. Look but at this. We found one. We found one. You think it's gonna have an IG block in it? It's probably stock. It's probably stock. <laughs> Damn. Sad. Oh well. Sad. A bunch of Subarus though, a bunch. But all of them are Outbacks, Foresters, and Legacies. That's it. Nothing else. We're here, guys. We just made it to IAG, it's 8.38, so we're on time. Let's find some place to park. Oh, and let's hope for an exciting day, guys. See you guys soon. Well, guys, uh, I know I know we're giving, we're giving you a lot of footage inside of the car. I don't know if that's gonna be the most exciting part of the video, but um, on the last clip, you guys saw that we had just arrived uh, to IAG. Of course, we're not allowed to film inside. I'm gonna give you my insight. Uh, my uh, my takeaway and in, in, in my experience with them. The guys at IAG guys are amazing. 
you know, amazing guys. Uh, I had a really good time. Uh, I learned a lot about their product, their, their history, uh, their beginning, their drive, what they want to do with the company, uh, what are they doing moving forward, what are the new plans, um, a lot of stuff that we're not supposed to uh, talk about it just yet on camera. So, but you guys will see, not not from IPS, but also from the side of IAG, for those of you guys that are a fan of the, uh, the brand, um, that they're, they're doing a lot of improvement and a lot of uh, changes to their to their uh, approach to uh, this business. And uh, and I think I think that's going to be very, very beneficial uh, for, for them and also for us because we are now officially uh, gold dealers. So uh, it is amazing to be a part of this. It's amazing to see what's going on with the community and, and, and us coming along uh, with the brand and whatnot and being a part of COP and all these other brands, ETS, uh, Liquid Mali, uh, all these brands that are being supportive to our business too. So, but for those of you guys that are interested in knowing how much stuff goes into details uh, with their engine and their uh, manufacturing of parts and whatnot, guys, it is insane. The, the attention to detail, the quality uh, control that they have, and every process and every step that every part has to go through. It is extremely, extremely intense on work, and not only work, but also quality control. Um, it is amazing. I'm, I'm super uh, fascinated and amazed about how they do the things. I saw it. I saw equipment and machinery that I've never seen in my entire life. Uh, a piece of equipment that are bigger than 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 my shop almost. Um, CNC machining uh, for manufacturing and CNC machining for modifying uh, parts and whatnot. And it's incredible the the way it's a production line more or less. Um, everybody seems to be really happy working on that environment. Uh, all the guys that are there are super cool. I, I really had the chance to talk to a lot of the crew. Um, there's a, there's a, a, a large amount of people working there, I'll tell you that much. Uh, but even from the assembly line, uh, from the manufacturing line, everybody was having a good time and everybody had a specific role and important uh, thing to do when it comes to either assembling engines or not only that, but also the manufacturing, the anodizing and um, welding. Uh, there's certain pieces that are hand weld. Uh, the quality of the weld uh, of the welds are it's so in, it's so incredible. You would think that everything get welded by a machine, but no, guys. There's a lot of the stuff they're still welding by hand with very, very, very precise um, measures, uh, measurements, and, and very specific. Uh, welds you know multiple people welding you would think that the weld would look different but it amazed me to see their them welding uh some of these pieces of equipment that they are coming out of the uh, uh, out of the line and they all looked identical it's incredible having you know multiple welders just having the quality uh all equal all of them the same um they of course they have you know a, a very rare nice setup uh for them to be welding constantly and and come out with that quality you know but it's amazing we're, we're super happy to be a part of this company i think the owners are very very customer uh, service oriented and that's what got us here not only the quality of the part but also the customer service orientation that they have i i am super happy to be a part of this uh, team of them so uh super happy to be a part of you guys uh thank you guys so much for the support i think we're gonna end the video here what is left for us we gotta fly back to uh to uh, Dallas and uh, we're have we're having a few hours to spare to spare uh, we have to wash the car and gas up the car and deal with all that boring stuff of returning the rental car that we have so uh, but thank you guys for watching the video to the end thank you guys for for the support that you guys have been giving us and also thank you guys for sharing our videos a lot of you guys are sharing our videos and our content and thank you so much for that we need we need this page to grow so if you guys are having friends that are car enthusiasts or they having a good they, they want to have a good time watching a video share like subscribe and uh put down comments uh put down below some comments if you want to see us doing something else if you have any suggestion um anything that you guys want us to fix like the quality of the video the length of video things of that nature if you have any any suggestion put it down below we're really interested in knowing what you guys are wanting to watch 
Uh, thank you guys so much. Once again, I keep repeating, thank you guys so much because I'm very thankful for all the support. So thank you guys again. Have a good time. Stay tuned. And uh, y'all have a blessed day. Peace.